Russian government is trying different ways to bring back IT specialists who left the country. The Ministry of Digital Development of the Russian Federation promises those who have returned a military draft exemption and a flight to Russia for the budget funds. Indeed, if we take two waves of outflows of IT specialists, up to 10% of employees of IT companies left the country and did not return. If we take the total, about 100,000 IT specialists are outside our country. At the same time, 80% of them continue to work for Russian companies in friendly countries. Maksud Shadaev, Minister of Digital Development, Communications and Mass Media of the Russian Federation during the government hour in the State Duma. However, for those IT specialists who work from abroad, even if they remain tax residents, the government plans to increase taxes on income of individuals from 13 to 30 percent. But such a measure, on the contrary, will provoke layoffs from Russian IT companies and transfer of specialists to foreign ones, experts say. There is a normative gap between the ministerial lists of companies and military enlistment officers, so military enlistment officers can still draft any employee. Ivan Pakrovsky, executive director of the Association of Developers and Manufacturers of Electronics, in an interview with the Commerçant publication. However, it is not worth counting on deferment from the army either. Ivan Pokrovsky, executive director of the Association of Developers and Manufacturers of Electronics, says that the deferment from the army for IT specialists and employees of the military-industrial complex is still not legislated. As for tough proposals such as ban on remote work and raising taxes to 30 percent, this method would only cause harm, because IT specialists will begin to lay off massively. Valentin Makarov, head of the Association of Software Developing Companies in Russia, Russoft, in an interview with the Commerçant publication. Experts explain that there was a deficit of real IT specialists in Russia earlier, but now their number has decreased significantly. In 2022, not only developers, but also analysts, marketing specialists, designers, project managers, artists, public figures, and many other citizens left Russia. According to Worry's data, every fifth entrepreneur has left the country. People are leaving. The mobilization on the one hand is partial, as they say, resulting in the withdrawal of, let's say, 300,000 people from the economy and sending them to the front. And about a million more have left Russia. And those are the citizens who left, the ones who had money and potential, and who, among others, things were working for the Russian economy. According to data from Johannes Wax, a researcher at the Complexity Science Hub Vienna, as of November 2022, the majority of Russian IT specialists left for the United States. A large outflow has gone to Russia's neighboring countries with the possibility of visa-free entry. Georgia, Armenia and Kazakhstan. Among the Western European countries chosen by Russians, the leaders are Germany, the Netherlands and Great Britain. Reported by Roman Smoller, Victoria Sinko, UATV News.